Oh yes indeed it's a triple dip today and a day after tornadoes ripped through the capital region it's a clear day today the first day of autumn great day to start a triple header the Eskimos and Red Blacks two seven and five football teams making the push to the postseason Harris turns and hands it off to Powell William Powell first down and more down inside the 20 and a big gainer is William Powell with that goes over a thousand yards Eskimos looking to hold the Red Blacks to a field goal attempt but Harris stands in fires touchdown JC Boyu flag down in the backfield illegal block thanks to the face Ottawa number 58 this is a 10 yard penalty still second down this is 31 in a row for the Ottawa GG kicker former security guard here at TD place off that win over Calgary Riley long side of the field and going backwards and going nowhere teams that know each other well Sid Moss of course used to be an offensive coordinator here in Ottawa and coach of the Eskimos and now Spencer look out here flag is down Spencer down the sideline was going to cut back to the 20 what a move he'll score a touchdown but it might come back. Prone to give up return. A 10-yard penalty and a first down Ottawa. So you've got to kind of know when to when to throw and when to let it go. Mike Riley's perfect so far. And what a catch on the sideline by the Duke. It's a flag down. They say he made that catch, got a foot in as he laid out. Loud crowd here at TV Play Stadium as usual. And he shovels it. To CJ Gable, who's going backwards, fumbled the football, and the Red Blacks have it. Back in 2016, wide open over the top with Sinopoli. So the streak continues. Harris gets time to throw the football because Edmonton has to worry about defending the run before they worry about rushing the passer. And a counter play once more. J.C. Beaulieu, first and goal, go the Red Blacks. Harris turns, loops it in, and it's a touchdown for Mark Corti. Flag down, and will this one be taken off the board? Pass interference, Ottawa number 88, who blocked downfield on a completed pass across the line of scrimmage. This is a 10-yard penalty. Harris fires end zone, and it's picked off. That seam. JC's busy as usual. Harris stepping up, and RJ Harris streaking down to the 15-yard line. With a good push up the middle from the SD line. Make it 33 straight, six away from tying the CFL record for most consecutive field goals. Sends out six, empties that backfield, and steps up and goes deep, and he has his man down inside the 35-yard line at Martise Jackson. Riley's calling his own number, and he's going to score, it looks like. He does. Eskimos rush four, delayed draw, and William Powell has daylight. Up to the 55, into Edmonton territory. This is a 39-yarder. Final play, first half. Can the streak continue for the Rook? Kick is up, and it is good! And so is the streak! Red Blacks will have a bye. Down the rail here. And catch him all over the catch! Deontay Spencer! Snaring that one. Harris, down he goes once more. The one family really cheering though, Lewis Morris. <laughs> Five today, 35 in a row. Based on the way this game started, especially with the way they were going downfield, you would have thought he'd have more offense. Riley has Mitchell. But that's his happy place. 
Looking for more here. And over the middle. Cool under fire here. Stands in again. Going in zone. Touchdown. The Duke. This guy's pretty good too. Not bad. CFL's best passer right now to the CFL's best receiver right now. Mike to pass. And we are tied up. Their ability to move the ball today, their inability to finish to the end zone. Now Harris. And it's picked up, and J.C. Sherritt is off to the races. He might get caught here, though. No, he will not. Oh, here comes Deontay Spencer. And Sherritt will score. Touchdown, Edmonton. Further review by the command center. They said that the ball carrier, the quarterback, was down with the football in his hand. This one's from just outside the 40. What a turnaround this could be as Lewis Ward does it again. Oh, my. Against the breeze. It's a to CJ. Gable has his biggest run of the ball game. And CJ down near the 15. Riley stands, fires, it's up for grabs. Rico Murray has it. This crazy game got crazier. Murray goes down. He not letting it bounce off those pads, but that one got in on him in a hurry. Here's that blitz again, and Harris has to chuck it off his back foot. And he has Bradsonopoli. His biggest play. Trying to punch it home here. Harris stands, throws. Down to the goal line, touchdown, Greg Ellingson. Must make here for Riley and the Eskimos. Comes that rush, Riley is going down, ball is loose. Eskimos have it, but the Red Blacks have it. Quite a few chip shots, but again, Money, seventh heaven again. Game that sometimes is all about the turnover, it was about the overturn today. The Red Blacks win 28 15.